Hello, welcome. I am Marcel. I'm a personal chef and here to support and inspire you with your diet. Today's video will be about how to change to natural cosmetic and toiletries. In the introduction video of this series, I already mentioned that when I say food, I don't only mean the food that we eat, but also the food that we take in in other parts of our bodies or senses. So cosmetic and toiletries such as shampoo, soap or even washing detergents and also toothpaste and sunscreens, all these products that we use every day or very often are not only lying on the surface of our skin but will also be absorbed in our bodies. That's why it is so important to not only look at the ingredient list in food products but also in shampoos, soaps, toothpaste or sunscreens and to see what ingredients are in there and what it means and if that is something that you really want to put on your body or not. I suggest to go with natural ingredients as much as possible. Most of these products contain a lot of chemicals and heavy metals that can cause cancer or numerous health issues and it also can interfere with your reproductive system. Animal testing is also a huge part for food, cosmetic and toiletries and I'm just asking myself if it's safe for our body, why does it need to be tested on animals? There is so much information out there. Please do your research if you want to know more about this. On PETA, for example, you can find companies who are testing their products on animals and also products that are cruelty-free. But I want to mention that only because it is cruelty-free doesn't mean that it is healthy for you because it can still contain a lot of chemicals and heavy metals. A lot of companies that label their products natural isn't necessarily natural, so be aware of that. Also here I suggest to go with real ingredients for your skin, your hair and your teeth. So you could use uh, different kinds of oils for example. There are so many variations uh, depending where you live and what temperature you are surrounded by. In cold environments for example the skin tends to dry out very very quickly. In that situation I would use shea butter or cacao butter. Um, it will keep your skin smooth and soft and nourished. You could use almond oil, moringa oil or argan oil. These oils are especially nice for the face. Uh, if you haven't heard about it before, then uh, I suggest you to give it a try. And toothpaste that is usually packed with harmful ingredients such as carrageen, fluoride, sulfate, artificial coloring and sweetener can be replaced with activated charcoal. Activated charcoal is a natural disinfector and whitener and if you combine it with coconut oil you can use that to replace your toothpaste. Don't be intimidated by the black color because your mouth will be all black but by the time you will get used to it, it is a much healthier version for you and also it is a cheaper way to have white teeth. As for shampoos and soaps, really look for products that only contain uh, natural ingredients and try out different options to find your favorite. And for perfume you could just combine water and essential oils or vanilla extract that is uh, pure and natural. It goes really well with your skin and smells divine. And as a body scrub you could make yourself a really nice and delicious sesame lavender scrub by just adding black sesame, white sesame in a food processor together with almond oil and uh, some drops of lavender essential oils. Blend it together until you have a really nice paste. You can adjust the uh, almond oil to your preferences and there you go. I hope this video was helpful and it has inspired you to do something differently. Thank you so much for watching and I'm looking forward to see you in my next video.